Hey everybody, Charlie Nine Two here, and welcome back to Riven, the sequel to Mist. We last left off. We figured out this ball puzzle after a few hits or misses and guesses, but I think we got it going now. We have some weird sound going on. We had a uh, huge reaction from this thing, so let's see what it did. Uh, I guess we should go back into the dome which means we should turn this three times one two three we need to go around here okay I gotta be honest doesn't look like anything's changed but there is a sound so, let's go check out, how do we get down there? We gotta go over here. Were these lights on before? They probably were. Nothing down here. Let's go check out this, uh, book. That's right, we gotta put this in again. It was, hold on, let me check my notes. 24, 14, 13, 12, and two. Yep, that was it. All right, is anything happening now? It is. Okay, we have fiery, fiery place. May not be fiery, it may just be evening sun. This is, he drew these. He drew these mountains on top of mountains. And there is, there's that, that satellite ditch. Okay, um, how do we go? We have to okay we have to watch this we can back out this seems like seems like a good time for a save save game uh, power on save let's make sure it's there okay cancel resume Right, what is this? It's more of these things with the books. Cannot go forward. Oh, look, that's a uh, sulfur island. That is bullshit door island. It says five. That says, can't tell. What is this? Can we go here? We can't go here. That is the jungle slash well island. That's the one we haven't been to yet. Let's go here. It says three. Okay. Is it supposed to play a video? All right, that one's not working. Is this one working? about this one can I back out yeah I can 
And this is the Sulphur Island. Huh. Well. Is there something else I can interact with? It was a button, I think. Oh! There's a man. Is this a uh, get? Or gate? I, I don't know how to say it. I'm sorry. Hey, that's that thing that was on his uh, desk. I apologize for the cage. I'm afraid this situation has often required of me a more primitive code of conduct than I might otherwise have chosen. You seem well spoken. I am Gen. Gen. I assume you've heard of me. Yes. Sorry, well, I, I butchered your you name. have acquired some false information of who I am now. Not that my son would have lied to you about me. No, not Atrus. It's just that. Well, I'm sure he believes me to still be the depraved father I once was. Yes. I even tried to kill him once. God, if I had accomplished that, who knows what I would have become. A great father indeed, who tries to murder his own son. Thankfully, he trapped me on age five, a prison of my own creation. No books, no precious inks. No ages to link to, nothing but my own foolish ambitions. That was 30 years ago. 30 years, 30 lifetimes, what does it matter? No sentence could be too harsh for the man I was. But I have changed. Have you? Be sure, the deeds of my past can never be completely atoned for. But my mission was an honorable one. Are you smoking the frogs? I'm sorry, this is all a bit awkward. I... It's been a long time since I've attempted to persuade anyone of my intentions. Most of the people here have already made their minds up about me one way or another. Weird audio glitch. I though. myself do not trust the words of most men, so I don't expect you to believe me. In the end, though, you may discover that I do have more than mere words to offer. Atrus's choice of punishment has been hard on the people of Riven, and many have suffered because of it. The island has been steadily decaying for years, but according to my most recent measurements, it appears that the Fifth Age has entered its final days. Unless the villagers can be relocated soon, the island will collapse entirely and everyone will perish. It has taken me a long time to do it, but it appears that finally I'll be able to make some substantial amends to my past transgressions, especially in... Well... I'm afraid I've had some... trouble with Catherine and the moiety. In any society, there will always be a small percentage of the population with rebellious tendencies. Before Catherine appeared, the moiety, as they call themselves, had been relatively harmless. I mean, the natives here are a fairly violent people by nature, but I'd almost come to accept their presence. It seemed inevitable under the circumstances. Upon Catherine's return, however, their violence intensified considerably. It seems she's become some sort of religious savior to them and as far as i can tell she's come to believe this herself so i've had no alternative i had to separate her from her people i 
I must admit, though, that my concerns were not entirely for her safety alone. The actions of Catherine and the moiety have put my own life at risk on numerous occasions. Consequently, the lives of all the people here. Therefore, I must ask you to refrain from any attempt to free her. Although I'm sure Atrus desires it. Indeed, he must desire it with all his heart. But he is completely unaware of her recent state. Are you Tywin Lannister? I know that you arrived in the Fifth Age with a book which was immediately stolen from you. Needless to say, its reacquisition is of interest to me, though my personal history with the moiety does not give me much hope for it. Still, there is a chance you might somehow manage to retrieve it. If you do, I would ask for the safety of all concerned that you bring it to me at your earliest opportunity. It's a prison book, dude. Again, to be honest, my reasons here are partly selfish. There is so much yet to be resolved between Atris and myself, especially in light of what has become of Catherine. In any case, my immediate concern is the completion of the sanctuary I've long promised to all the islanders. In the meantime, as a token of my good intentions, I will allow you free access to my linking books crude though they may be, and to the rest of the Fifth Age. Okay. But that's because you want that book. I want some goggles you got. As for the stolen linking book, we should probably not meet again until you've recovered it. I will know if you succeeded, and will await your return. Good luck with your search. I hope to see you back here shortly. I prefer that type of villain, the well-spoken in intellectual. They're always more interesting to me. All right, music's fading out. So where do we go? Well, I want to go to the... I want to go see what this... Uh, well, there's a handle here. Can I hit that? If we press this, that doesn't do anything. Okay. So the book should work now. I want to go to the one that has the single Tetris piece this one because we haven't been here right this is the tree stump island yeah and it has a dome which is the well is there a point to these domes anymore it's the half awake vertical eye which is blue but we've already figured out this is blue right just by trial and error so we know tree stump island equal blue I'll write it down just in case we need it but we should be able to know that uh, that that's what it was. All right, let's click it. Oh, this is where it took us to. Okay, all right, that makes sense why this dome would be here, because we just came out of it. Yeah, this is a tree stump, isn't it? Oh, I like the music. I also like this water, it's beautiful. Okay. It's like a bunker. Okay.
Oh, I didn't press any of those things, though. I should probably press some of those things. Let's watch where that pipe is going to. It goes over. So this is where... Yeah, this is where she was. You made it. It's Catherine, right? But how'd you get past Ken? He must really believe I've gone mad. I know what he's doing. He's watching you. He's waiting for you to make a mistake. He's hoping you'll lead him back to Danny. You can't let Gen... Atrus sent you to save me. But if Gen gets back to Danny, he'll kill him. Find the moiety. They have the book. Be careful. Find the moiety. Go then. Tell me how to find the moiety. If you won't help me, then I have nothing more to say. That's a nice touch for in the mirror over there. Find the moiety. I also want to press the little buttons on the wall. Where do you go out there? Is there like a little pavilion? Can I turn? I hit that. Yeah, I gotta go back down. Hit escape. What is this? Three tones. This is to unlock her cell, right? Alright, I gotta listen for these tones somewhere. Clack. A like a trill sound and a ding. Okay. Okay. Well, there didn't appear to be a whole heck of a lot to do on this one. Do we have to put the? We have to put this in every time. So if you just knew this from playing this before, you could just like roll through this. Skip it, go here, skip it, go here, skip it, go here. All right, so, hmm. I feel like we're like at level two. Figuring out the uh, island ball puzzle has unlocked level two for us. I might as well go here. This is the underwater train slash jungle fish area. Which means it should just take us to Yeah, it would just take us here where we've already been. So what's the reason to go there? What about here? This would just take us to the one that we've already been to here too, right? Oh crap. I feel like I'm stuck again. We can easily see the uh, the eye on these, but I think we've already solved that, so we don't really need... I oh. don't know. No, skip this. Go out. Is there anywhere else to go? That does that. We can't reach that. This one? We've been to this one, right? 
This is the one that's in the uh, bullshit doors area. No, no, no. This is the uh, island. The, uh, the island with the big dome on it. Okay. And over here. So this is the only one that's different. She told us to see the moiety. The only other puzzle I know of is the one with the animals. And that's here. Let's go here. Okay, so we're here again. We need to find more eyeballs. There's this asshole. No, I know it's paused. I'm sorry. This guy rings the alarm. I don't know what that, what the significance is of that. Don't see anything over here. In here was the ability to raise and lower the well, this throne, if you were, if it were. Raise it, and then we can look down. We can close that. Or open it. I don't really see a reason to have it closed anymore, because we have a shortcut. Let's go back over here. Maybe we missed something. Go down. Go out. Look for... Eyeballs. Um, there was this. There's the fish. We need to go. Can we go up any higher? We can't. We need to go down. Gonna take us to the fish mouth. Can't skip this for some reason. Strange. Let's click this. Can't skip that one. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is there anything in here? Is there anything here? These look like the eyes, but they can't do anything with them. Huh. Listen to the sounds more. So we need to go, I went the wrong way. I want to go back in here. I want to go to where the path was, where the prisoner guy was. It was through here. Is this guy going to ring the alarm again? No. I don't like him. I don't know why. Blue path down. Turn around. We want to go up here. Turn around. Check. All around. This thing was looking at a fish. Or the silhouette of a fish, right? So, it's looking right here. I don't know if that does anything for us. I don't think it does. It's looking right at us, right here, right? No, that's dumb. Okay, let's go back up here. Let's go through the dark hallway, which was here. Oh, we gotta open it again. Let's 
skip at, skip at. Go here, go here. We should look in here more. Oh. Pull this, open that, go in here. Are all the lights still on? Yeah, they are. Okay, let's go back towards the little water area. Okay, don't see anything here. I don't know what I was thinking. I just assumed that when we got access to those books that we were gonna have more stuff to go look at, but clearly that's not the case. Are there any more hints in this room? See, that's the symbol of those moiety people. So we need to go there. But I have no way of knowing which one of these to click or how many or what to do. Is this different? No, this is where it just came from. I thought it was a different path. Nothing this way, this way, this way. All right, let's, uh, let's use our brains here. According to my notes, I have found four eyeballs. One eye that has the number one is in the fan office, in the laboratory desk. Another one, which would be number four, if it's one through five, I am missing. Don't know where it is, what it could be. What animal would make the sound that we heard in the fan office? Would it be this thing? I don't think so. But then again, we haven't really seen any other animals, right? It's a frog. Freaking alien. Is this like a hummingbird? Fish. And we're all the way back around. There's no way we looked at them all, right? Hmm. Is there any visual reference here? Nope, nope, turn around. I swear I saw this fish. This fish this exact symbol was underwater. Let's go to the underwater place and look at that. Is there anything else up here? It's possible. What if we go down with this? Will we die? It won't let us. That's where that came down from. This guy's free. Tell you what, let's go to the village and see if they've changed. Maybe they will speak to us. Highly doubt it. This was the fish area, right? Or was it this one? I don't know. I can't tell. All right, let's go up and talk to them. Hey, folks. Will you let me in now? It doesn't appear so. And then these guys are still closed off. How did this get back up here? 
Answer me that. Who brought this back up? It wasn't me. I didn't do that. Is the meat still in here? It is. Huh. That's the fish. I just saw them. Where were they at? Ah, oh, I just saw them. Right here. These are the fish, right? Can I touch them? Oh, we can look up here. There needs to be more places that we can look up. Surely that's what I've missed, right? We can look up here. Why does it zoom in here? It's like we can do something. Alright, I guess we'll have to find out next episode. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy my content, please consider a like, a comment, and or a subscribe. Stay tuned for the next episode. We'll see you then. Bye-bye.